Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a brand new video. I've got such an exciting video. Honestly, I'm so excited for today's video. I haven't filmed a haul in what feels like forever and a day. If you guys have been following me here on YouTube and if you've been following me on Instagram as well, you will know that I've been on a spending ban for this year so far. I've not allowed myself to buy any clothes or any beauty items or anything for the year so far and I've finally finally let myself go crazy on clothes and beauty and everything expensive so yeah i was just on a bit of like a savings savings journey and now i'm letting myself off that leash and here we are with a huge asos haul so as you can imagine as a little shopping addict over here not shopping for like three months and then be to let wild on asos was just it was an experience, I will say that. So I literally spent like 200 quid on ASOS and I ordered loads of like random bits and I also ordered stuff that I've been wanting for a really long time. Um, a couple of the pieces that I'm gonna share with you guys, I've literally had my eye on for like a year or like a few years. You know like when you see something and you're like, oh my God, I could do with that in my wardrobe, but you just never buy it. Do you guys know what I mean? I've got a few pieces like that so I'm just so excited to share with you guys what I've got. Literally so much of this stuff I'm going to be adding to my wardrobe. There was a couple of pieces that didn't really look right on me, I didn't think anyway. I'll share them with you guys anyway even though I'm probably going to return them. If you guys watch my reel on Instagram you'll have seen a couple of the pieces but I've got some sunglasses, I've got some shoes to show with you guys and yeah a couple of extra bits. So yeah oh my god there's quite a bit to get through so I am going to stop rambling on and stop introing this video. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, be sure to like it, subscribe down below if you haven't already, and let's get into the video. The first thing is a pair of sunnies, which I wanted to show you guys the little bag that they came in because I thought it was quite cute. These are from Under the Stories. Obviously, I got them on ASOS. They look like this. I'll try them on for you guys. I've worn them in so many pictures on Instagram so far. It's actually been like the sunniest, most gorgeous couple of days here in Yorkshire. So I've actually been wearing these like out and about, which now looking at the rainy weather, I'm like, how have I even worn these? But yeah, they're so gorgeous. I absolutely love them. They were 27 quid. They are amazing. And I'll tell you for why. Um, I think so many of you guys will be able to relate to this. So you know like when you buy sunnies and they've got like the little nose, um, they're kind of like nose stabilizers definitely not the right word but the little things that go on your nose that like help the sunglasses stay in place which mean that when you put them like in your hair they get stuck they haven't got those um so you can literally just put them in your hair and it doesn't mess up your hair or get stuck in your hair which is just the most annoying thing so yeah they're just perfect i don't think 27 quid is too bad for some sunglasses this is me just cleaning the sunglasses yeah i thought that was quite good and they are really really sturdy as well loved the little like um, I don't know what pattern that is. It's like tortoise shell on the sides. Beautiful. They were literally like one of the first things that I put in my basket. Sunglasses just make me so excited for summer. Okay, the next thing is this beautiful satin skirt. I'm going to put in overlays over the top of these clips so you can see what everything looks like. But it's this gorgeous satin midi skirt that looks like this. I honestly love the material of this. It feels really, really good quality. It's an ASOS design piece and I don't know about you, but I'm such a fan of ASOS design because they are a little bit cheaper than your average brand, but they're still really good quality. So I got this in a size 10 and it fits like a dream. It's really, really comfortable. It's got a lovely elastic waist. This is one of the items actually that I have wanted for years. Like I've seen so many people style a black satin midi skirt with outfits that look so, so nice. And I've just never, ever had a plain one. I've had so many mini skirts in my time, but they've always been like patterned and a bit funky. Whereas this this one I feel like I'm gonna wear a lot because I'm gonna be able to style it with so much stuff. I think from memory this was about £28 which I think you know what I'm gonna wear this so much it's definitely worth it. I just love 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 the material. So that was the next thing that I got and I'm definitely gonna keep that because I love it. The next thing is actually a pair of trousers they're like smart joggers. I'm gonna insert some clips over the top because I've actually got these on right now with this outfit that I'm wearing right now so I can't actually hold them up and share them with you guys but they are these gorgeous kind of like cigarette style joggers they're so so comfy they've got a huge huge elastic band like that big that goes around your waist which makes them so so comfortable these are definitely going to be my go-to working from home trousers because they're just so so comfy and they're actually quite warm as well like the material isn't really really thin they're like perfect for a uh, grey cloudy day. These are obviously black so they're gonna go with so much. I don't know if they had other colours but I guess if you typed in like smart 
jogger style trousers you'd be able to find different colors but I really really wanted some black ones because I feel like I'm gonna be able to style them with loads and they fit like a dream I got these in a size 10 and I think they were about 30 quid I think I can't quite remember the prices of everything but I will link everything down below so you can see it in the description box okay next up is a coard which I am so excited to share with you guys I've not had anything like this I don't think ever so it's like a toweling material cream coard set i found this in the loungewear section on asos it's got like this half zip up the top and it goes right up your neck so it does actually keep you pretty warm um as i said like the material is toweling really really soft i love the color the actual inside of it is just nice soft material and then the shorts that go with it look like this I think I got this in a size 10. If it's not a size 10, it's a medium. Yeah, super cosy, elastic waist shorts. I just love the colour. It's kind of like a lemon yellow, even though I'm pretty sure it said cream on the website. But when it's arrived, it kind of does look a little bit borderline lemon. It's, it's like in between cream and lemon um, and I really really like it I think the top was 18 quid and the bottoms were 14 I think it came to like 32 pounds or something does that even add up something around the 30 pound mark anyway for both of them the only bad thing about these which is kind of putting me off a little bit is that they are quite see-through and that is literally just down to the material I don't think it's down to the quality or anything because I think they're good quality but they're a little bit see-through but I guess I wouldn't really wear these like out of the house that much these are more for like just chilling in the evening like after work in winter I literally always put my cozies on and then my dressing gown whereas in summer obviously it's going to be a little bit too hot for that so I'm kind of trying to think like what can I wear in the evenings to just chill out and I kind of wanted something like this but I don't know if see-through is going to work so let me know what you guys think to that one in the comments I would be interested to know what you guys think it's kind of like a stylish loungewear set which I kind of love okay the next thing is I guess another kind of coard. It's just like a matching tracksuit, really. I got this lilac matching tracksuit. So this is what the jumper looks like. It's so in your face. It says, have a great day. And it's got this huge smiley face on it. Honestly, I'm not joking you. This material is so soft. It's, oh my God, it's so warm and soft and cozy. So that is the jumper. And then this is what the joggers look like. Um, these say remember to smile. I actually got these in a size small and they are so oversized I'm not joking you like not even a little bit oversized when you see me trying them on you'll literally be like oh my god That's quite big. Sorry. No, I got that wrong I got these in a size 10 which I guess is kind of like a small anyway I don't really know but yeah size 10 honestly though these are so big like I love an oversized jumper like this one I've got on right now it's quite oversized, but I feel like an oversized hoodie and oversized joggers that kind of like crumple up at the bottom because I'm five foot five and these are quite long for me so I hate it when joggers do like all that at the bottom knee foot do you know what I mean I feel like this is really really cute but I would be inclined to get a size below or maybe even two sizes below what I am because it's just so big and I honestly think I would like overheat in it it's that big and warm I think I'm gonna return these let me know what you guys think in the comments to that tracksuit but yeah I I'm a little bit unsure on that because it's just so so oversized and I think I kind of look like I'm wearing like my dad's tracksuit they're that big okay next up is a dress now this is like a casual day dress it's a maxi dress and it's from ASOS design it looks like this it kind of reminds me of the monkey t-shirts I've got a few if you do online shopping way too much like me you'll have seen the little monkey t-shirts that are long sleeved and they're stripy it kind of reminds me of that um but anyway got this in a size 10 it's got khaki is like the main color and then the stripes kind of like this gray color um which I actually really really like it's kind of like a neutral vibe yeah it's really really maxi though like literally I'm not joking you it comes down to like just below my ankles like it doesn't touch the floor but it's really long I kind of chucked this in my basket at last minute and I kind of wasn't thinking about it but I actually don't really like how this looks on me I think I look a little bit frumpy in it and I don't really think it complements me in any way I just don't feel like it's me you know I mean the material is lovely it feels so soft honestly it's gorgeous but it's just it's just not really me if you guys have watched me for a while you'll see like that's just not my style it just doesn't scream Leah does it so that is definitely going to be returned but I still thought I would include it in this haul so you guys can see okay I'm switching things up a little bit and I've got a couple pairs of shoes to show with you guys um you guys are literally going to be like Leah 
Leah. I bought some heels for all that clubbing that I go out and do. Yeah. This is what they look like. They've got a little like square heel. You can see better there. Um, and they've got this like tie knot in the middle. They, I think they were about 30 quid. Um, but the reason I've bought them is because when we can go back out to drink and for meals and stuff, I just want to have a nice go-to pair of heels and I don't currently have any. Um, I think I've got like one pair of boots, but I mean, I don't want to be wearing boots in summer. So I picked these up and I really, really like them. I love the square front as well. I think I've got a clip to show you guys what they look like, but I just thought they were like a really classy pair of heels and I think I'll probably get my wear out of them. I'm one of those people who, if I've got like one pair of go-to shoes, I will literally wear them to death. So I feel like if they're just like my going out shoes, they'll probably go with a lot because they're black. I think I'll get my wire out of them so I'm gonna keep them. Let me know what you guys think to those in the comments. Oh my god is this the last thing? Oh my god it is. This is the last thing. This is another pair of shoes that I picked up. I think you guys are going to like these. Um, you can't quite see because I've not done the buckles up but they are this pair of sandals. Hang on let me just try trying to give you guys a little bit of a vibe of what they look like. This is what they look like. They kind of remind me of the Doc Martin sandals that literally everybody bought last year. I don't think I would actually want the Doc Martin ones because I don't think I would wear them enough to justify the price, but I really, really liked these ones. These are actually from Shoe. You can see on the sole it says Shoe. I don't even know if this is making them look good. It makes them look so weird, doesn't it? But this is what they look like anyway. I wore them out on a day trip yesterday. Was it yesterday? Yeah. And I'm not gonna lie, they did rub me a little bit here, but I literally think that was because um, it was the first time I'd ever worn them and it was boiling, boiling hot as well. They are actually really comfy and they've got little, um, little like markers on here, on like the sole, where your foot should go. So it just makes them a little bit more comfy. And I think they're gonna go with so much because they're just those kind of sandals. They're black and they are just pretty simple and basic, but I absolutely loved them. Um, and I think the straps at the top are leather, um, which is probably another reason as to why they rubbed a bit because leather does rub, doesn't it? But yeah, these are the shoes. They've got good grips on the bottom as well. So that is everything that I picked up from ASOS. Honestly, I absolutely loved finally being able to online shop. I mean, I say it as if I've literally like not been able to do online shopping which I have but I've just not personally allowed myself to but yeah I really really hope you enjoyed this video let me know what you guys really liked from this haul let me know what your favorite thing was I think mine well I want to say the sunglasses but honestly these like joggers that I've got on right now <laughs> I love how that's how I show you like look at my leg these are honestly so comfy and the fact that I've got them on right now it's probably quite telling as to like how often I'm gonna wear them so probably these joggers are my favorite things but yeah let me know in the comments what you guys liked thank you so so much for watching this video sorry there wasn't a weekly vlog this week by the way i told you guys that on instagram the other day anyway but yeah no weekly this week but there will be one next week um they'll go back to normal like every sunday from next week i thought this would be quite fun to share with you guys instead of a weekly vlog so yeah hope you enjoyed it hope you've all had a lovely lovely week hope you're enjoying the four day weekend as well happy easter eat loads of chocolate enjoy your day and i will see you very soon for a new video bye guys